What it do, flight crew? FTC. Flight team, stand up! Hey, man, is Flight React playing a character? We're going to find out today, so let's check it out. It's one of those conspiracy videos that people like to make. In basketball and YouTube, then you are more than likely familiar with the name Flight Reacts. What it do, Flight Crew, FTC, Flight Team Stand Up! Flight has been a staple in the community for several years now, providing entertainment through his hot takes. See, Reddick is a casual. Rage. Bitch. 1v1s, and of course, dumb moments. However, I would say dumb is a very generous way of describing flight sometimes. Move! Or a buffalo or some shit that fight! Where the fuck are you Bro, this dude is a dumbass, it's a deer! Now, YouTubers have a job to entertain their audience, and in doing so, they will often act as an exaggerated version of themselves. However, when it comes to flight reacts, his personality is... You know this dude literally just fucked up, right? You know this dude fucked up, right? He literally fucked up. Like, you literally just contradicted everything you just said about this video. Listen. Okay, bro, this dude is a dumbass. Yeah. It's a deer. Now, YouTubers have a job to entertain their audience. And in doing so, they will often act as an exaggerated version of themselves. Exaggerated version of themselves. That's all I got to say. You literally just answered the question. Because I already know the type of video he's probably going to make. He's going to be doing something as he playing a character, role, this and that. Look, bro, if you don't understand entertainment at this point in 2020, you take things too seriously, my dude. And this is just for anybody. It's just not for him. I don't want you to think I'm coming at him. You know what I'm saying? There's something that loose screws up in your head. You know what I'm saying? Most of the time when people go out the way and try and make things like this or go deep into conspiracies, bro, you have nothing going down in your life. You know what I'm saying? This, Like I said, once again, this is towards everybody that has these types of opinion towards me. You know what I'm saying? Focus on your own self and your bag and maybe your life will be better. Now, second, how are you going to sit up here and say it's Flight Reacts playing a character when you just stated that YouTubers, you know what I'm saying, or anybody that makes YouTube videos or whatever, plays an exaggeration character of themselves. Because the reason why I keep saying that part is because a lot of people will be saying things like, oh, flight's different in person, this and that. Uh, bro, of course I'm going to be chill. Of course I'm not going to be motherfucking hyper. Or I'm not going to be flapping my tongue everywhere if something's not funny. You think I'm just going to be walking out of a store and flapping my tongue everywhere, doing a dog for left randomly if something's not funny? You know what I'm saying? Like... Get some IQ in your head. Go chase you a bag. You know what I'm saying? It's getting sad. It's crazy how, and even 2020, because sometimes I'll take the time to look at, you know what I'm saying, like comments on other people's videos, and they'll just be like, oh, I heard from flights, you know what I'm saying? Uh, other people he's been around, yada, yada, yada. You know what I'm saying? He's a different person. Shut your bitch ass up, my nigga. He just said it. You have to not exactly exaggerate. You be a little bit more animated. I have 10 plus personalities. You know what I'm saying? Like, you have a different flight right now and then a different flight in 10 minutes. And then also I'm bipolar too. You know what I'm saying? So the same version you're not going to see on the camera. I just know how to turn up when the cameras are on. When the cameras are on, it's a different story. Let's continue. However, when it comes to flight reacts, his personality is... Uh, flight is clearly one of the most entertaining YouTubers, particularly in the basketball world. But I refuse to believe he isn't acting in one way or another when saying some of the stuff he says. Bro, get some water. So being stuck in the like house, I was curious, so was it fucking get water with the fire? The biggest troll of all time. <laughs> or he actually <laughs> genuinely believes what he's saying. Nah, I'm already cash. Let's go, man. This list is inspirational. Which I hope isn't the case. So in order to figure this out, we have to go back to the origins of flight, and that's exactly what I did. I went back and watched a few of Flight's older uploads and tried to understand his personality. <laughs> Bro, Jasmine's mentality. Y'all yeah, still there flexing my whole fucking uh. I come back from Steak and Shake, or was I fired at that time, or Chick-fil-A, one of those. And I'm sitting there flexing my damn work paycheck. It was literally like 300 bucks, working my ass off two weeks. <laughs> oh my gosh, man. Thank God for the glow up, you know what I'm saying, in FTC, man. Oh, man. And this the is first cringy. thing that was apparent was, Fight was a pretty straightforward, chill 2K YouTuber. He still had a few catchphrases. See, like, and this is the thing that this dude doesn't even know me, like, I'm more of NBA Live. Like, it was just not straight 2K. Like, you're sitting up there talking about 2K when I have live in the background. Goofball. And moments of hype, but he was far from what we see today. The first major... Bro, of course, everybody is not going to be as fucking animated and as motherfucking turned up with anything they do. That's anything. Not even just YouTube. Like, the hip-hop world, um, the NFL, NBA... More people are explosive when they get used to it and get their feet wet. You know what I'm saying? Even right now, like, 
You're sitting up there making this video. You sound like you're using a motherfucking like a, a, a 13-year-old fucking kid Toys R Us mic right now, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, why well, hell of a was this video flight rating perfectly fine? The eco motion engine, 2K's groundbreaking dynamic gameplay engine. And this Facts. is the flag. And I mean, I told y'all, like, if you don't know how to read the back of any game manual, then there's something wrong with you. Everybody knows how to read any type of video game manual. It's just common facts. So vocab words fix, especially if you're a gamer in a way too. The vocab words just come senses to you in second nature. You know what I'm saying? And second, I was speed reading. Is well, flight can't read. 2K Nasiali Jaya, the only NBA 2K player would understand. And unless he developed dementia at 20 years of age, which I hope he hasn't, then I think he does it for the content. And I don't think flight smoking is the reason for this. Unless flight is smoking something a bit heavier than wheat, and if that's the case. Lay off at flight. So to get to the point, <laughs> what is this dude talking about, bro? Today, we have to figure out when he flipped that. Whoa! Mary's Whoa! What the fuck did I just see? Yo! Bro! Come on! Actions are yet to this. Bro, okay, man. Oh my gosh, I'm not gonna replay that. Alright, man. I'm not even gonna lie, bro. With that flip challenge stuff, dude. The only person that literally can get away with that is literally your rage. Your rage is the only person that can get away with doing that, bro. Everybody else that did that flip challenge, bro, and was wearing the girl stuff, bro, I don't even know, bro. Like, you would never see me do something like that. But your rage, he gets a pass because your rage is goaded and he's immortal and he's just, it's just one of a kind. But I really wish I didn't see that, you know, try to erase my memory. All right, it's gone now. Gotta, you know, I had to press rewind in my life. You know you can go back in time too and press rewind them. You know on certain things, you just gotta you know do that. Yeah. I want flight to know I was recording. This is what I did record though. After a year of relatively consistent uploading from 2013 through to 2014, flight took a significant break from YouTube to return midway through June 2015. Bro, like you don't know anything about me. What the fuck is you talking about? When I started in 2013, I never took a break from YouTube. I never left for two years and then came back the next year. First of all, if you're going to make a conspiracy video like this, have some real facts. This is these are this is probably somebody that just subscribed to me like six months ago. Just started hopping on the bandwagon and everything. And thinks they know everything about my entire life, my nigga. I made my reaction channel Flight Reacts within 20, the end of 2014 going into 2015. No, the end of 2015 going into now. You know what I'm saying? That's when I made Flight Reacts. And I never took a break. What the fuck is you talking about, bro? In a quest to show his viewers that NBA Live was the best NBA game on the market, which was probably the first sign that something was not right. So this first upload in a year was definitely the beginning of the flight reacts we see today, as he became a far more enthusiastic and energetic person, which resulted in more- That's what happens when you hit a flip switch or hit a switch or whatever, and you be like, okay, it's time to turn up now. It's time to take this seriously. It's time to, you know what I'm saying, turn your quality up. Something that this person that's making the video should do instead of using the damn potato as a mic, bro. Like, views and a bigger audience. But from this point on, Flight just continued to experiment with ways to grow. Dropping a music video in 2015. Oh, keep it alive. That was a skit, though. That wasn't a music video, by the way. A few months later. Now, it's hard to pinpoint the exact time in which Flight lost his ability to read and pronounce names. Don shit? You mean Donicate? It's Luca Donicate. With multiple years of content suggesting that he was a capable reader and could actually pronounce names properly, I find it hard to believe that Flight regressed in intelligence this much naturally without it being a part of his act. So after doing the research that no one wanted to do, my conclusion is, unless Flight developed dyslexia at 20 years of age, after showing no symptoms beforehand, he's clearly able to read, yet just chooses to leave out chunks of sentences and just- Yeah, cause your stupid ass decides to read the full sentence like a casual you are. Instead me, like I've said 30 million times, it's called speed reading. If you know what, for example, the word after means, and you know what the fuck, how to say it, why pronounce the word? When 90% of the audience that's listening to you read knows what that word means, why pronounce the word and you know it right there so you can speed read and read faster, bro? You know what I'm saying? People that are always saying this stuff, he probably reads with his finger. Like, pronounce words and names. And this was seen in a recent video in which you can see flight smirking when pronouncing Pascal Siakam as what? Pastel Sidecom. Bro, you compared him to Pastel Sidecom, bro? That's so disrespectful, bro. Facts. 
That's like, his name, right? He's so disrespectful. He knows he doesn't even have his is is the, the pastel side come do, which is a combination of a crayon and I don't know a crayon end. What the hell is this dude talking? Character after saying something so dumb that even he couldn't go along with it. <laughs> this dude's so trying so hard, like, bro. It's fair to say I love it though. Thanks for the content, though. React to buddy. Stuff that he says, but how much acting is he doing? That's a question that's tough to answer. His movements on and off the court suggest he's a bit of a different kind of guy, but how different is hard to tell over the internet. He's either been talking nonsense for so long that it comes naturally to him, or he actually believes what he's saying. Now, I'd like to believe it's mostly for content, particularly when it comes to stuff like this. Whoa, is that a lion, bro? Seals don't make that noise. But I can't say it with full certainty. However, the main question that still remains unanswered, does Flight Reacts actually believe he is a good basketball player? Now, when tracking down Flight's first in real life basketball video, I had to try and see the confidence in him, and it doesn't take long to recognize it has always been there. After hitting his first three-pointer late in the video, following about 10 missed jump shots beforehand, which were probably lucky to make the cut. I mean, most people edit out their misses and show most of their makes, but I think Flight was sitting there editing the video going, yeah, that's a good miss there. That hit rim. Yeah, that clipped the side of the backboard from the corner. That's not too bad, really. Let's leave that in. It makes me look good. So after seeing the confidence of Flight following his one made three-point field goal, reminiscent of every 1v1 or in real life basketball game he's ever played, I am led to believe Flight might actually believe he is a good basketball player, despite the countless L's, the countless comments, and even videos detailing how he shoots about 15% from beyond the arc. So to wrap it up, I do believe Flight Reacts is saying some of this stuff for entertainment purposes. Bro, have you heard the rumors? Giannis a cunt pokes. Giannis a cunt pokes. Of course. They're gonna <laughs> be He's 7 8 can handle the book. However, I'm not going to give Flight a pass for all the stuff he's said over the years because I know full well he has meant some of that stuff. But regardless of this, Flight is a pretty hilarious entertainer who has been a staple in the community for a long time and I hope he continues to entertain. I could very well be proven wrong in June when Flight discovers his full form, similar to LeBron in the playoffs or James Harden in the regular season. With all this being said, hey man, we gotta look at this like 10 times and just trying to do great things in the world, you know what I'm saying? Facts, yo. Hey man, that's where you kept it all, man. That's good to me. Coming all the way around your neck, man. I don't know that too, Millie, Millie.